Tiana didn't have luck the other day in 1500 meters, but today luck went her way. Yeah, I think you know, the, I have a little bit of feeling, but uh, we did a plan to skating well because she has a 1500 uh, tolerance like. But unfortunately, uh, his, uh, her his uh, was fast. Uh, everyone knows she come from the Netherlands, set up, you know, got you know, gold medal in the 1500 long track. I, I did not, uh, you know, thinking too far today. I think, you know, first plan just, uh, you know, probably get a, uh, get her to uh, crash some people to the start. I think you can see the pace start very fast. But uh, I think it, I did not realize that they can fighting and uh, seven, almost seven, I left to go. So I think uh, she deserved to have a little bit lucky on the first round. I wish, you know, that I was exciting. Maybe now we set down, plan to try to move next round. Diana said at the end that she'd been a little bit sick with an ear infection. Are you confident that she can bounce back from the trouble that she's had with that to perform well on Friday? Yeah, that's right. So I just heard that last night she got an ear infection. I think uh, Olympic uh, starts different with the World Cup World Championships, uh, you know, so you have uh, uh, hold that pressure duration from uh, you know since the start the 10th of February until 21. It's uh, such a long, uh, long period. I have two skaters up here and uh, Diana. They were young, and uh, first time in the Olympic game, they already make the dream, you know, the come true. And we just trying to go into skating to challenge the people who is uh, come from world best uh, in the top 32, top 36 in both the di three distance. Yeah. How tough will it be for Diana to progress through to the semis? That should be tough. In the top 16, it's everyone is very fast. I think uh, her speed is not that uh, enough, but sometimes uh, you have a di different strategy. Some people, some another, you know, the people maybe do it different another. Everyone wants to win. Everyone wants to win. So we will see. Australia is such a, such a small country um, for the sport of short track, and to have someone in the quarterfinals and already in the top 16 is pretty awesome.